नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज अ लेडी सफरिंग फ्रॉम सडन पेनफुल लॉस ऑफ विजन विद वर्सनिंग ऑफ पेन ऑन द आई मूवमेंट्स एंड आर ए पी डी इज ऑल्सो प्रेजेंट सेंट्रल स्कोटोमा इज ऑल्सो प्रेजेंट सो अगेन अ गुड क्वेश्चन एंड दे हैव गिवन यू लॉट ऑफ क्लूज टू वर्ड्स द डायग्नोसिस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इट्स अ सडन पेनफुल लॉस ऑफ विजन एंड द पेन ऑन ऑक्यूलर मूवमेंट सो दिस एक्चुअली पॉइंट्स टू वर्ड्स द डायग्नोसिस ऑफ द ऑप्टिक न्यूराइटिस डायग्नोसिस वेर यू आर हैविंग द सडन पेनफुल डिमिनेशन ऑफ विजन एंड देर इज ऑल्सो पेन ऑन ऑक्यूलर मूवमेंट्स देन दे आर सेंग दैट देर इज अ आर ए पी डी रेप and that is relative afferent pupillary defect in afferent nerve is the optic nerve so that also points towards the optic neuritis and one of the earliest manifestation of the optic nerve disease is rapd right then you can confirm it from the perimetry finding because in cases of optic neuritis you get either the central scotoma or we get the centro cecal scotoma either we get the central scotoma or we will get centro cecal scotoma what do you mean by cecal here cecal means which is involving the blind spot which is actually involving the blind spot so if the scotoma involves the blind spot it is centro cecal so what is the answer here optic neuritis central scotoma can be found rapd could be found papilledema now in papilledema you will not have no pain on ocular movements then you will have uh, the enlargement of the blind spot what is the perimetry finding there will be enlargement of the blind spot there will be obscuration of the nasal margins there will be obscuration of venous pulsations there could be champagne cock appearance so it's very very different from that of the optic neuritis retinoblastoma now a person who is having retinoblastoma first of all the age should be less than 3 years most common age of diagnosis of retinoblastoma and what are the most common modes of presentation if it is a patient of retinoblastoma the most common is the leukocoria so whitish pupillary reflex along with this there could be a squint then along with this there could be a glaucoma these are the most common presentations of a patient who is having the retinoblastoma and most common age of presentation is 1 and 1/2 years so 1 and 1/2 years with leukocoria with squint that is mostly convergent squint then with glaucoma with nystagmus it could be a erd all these things along with the poor vision these are the things that we require for the diagnosis of the retinoblastoma so it's not retinoblastoma it's not papilledema then we come to the crvo now crvo is clearly outlined because you know this is a painful diminution of vision while crvo will be painless all the vascular occlusions are painless whether it is crao or whether it is crvo so again a direct question from our classroom notes of the optic neuritis we have unilateral sudden profound total loss of vision and there is painful deep orbital pain and this pain is aggravated by the ocular movements right